Hello everybody, welcome back to Minifig Reviews, and today, to start off my LEGO DC Super Heroes series on my channel, I would like to use my favorite minifigure from that series, and that of course is the DCEU Ezra Miller Flash minifigure. Now, without further ado, let's get right into the review. So, before I check the minifigure, I want to talk about the Power Blasts. Um, you got these before with Spider-Man, and they were white and stuff, but I don't, you don't see them a, a lot nowadays um, in sets. They were replaced by um, these molds here. All these new pieces that came out in Infinity War um, and stuff. And I know there's new Batman battering stuff coming out, that, or have come out by the time of this video. So, I mean, they're kind of being replaced. But, um, it's a simple function. You get them and you squeeze them on a minifigure and they shoot out for Power Blast. Um, pretty cool mold to get these in this color. Now let's get back onto the minifigure. So this minifigure is a Flash, of course. Um, he's a great minifig. Um, as you can see, he has excellent coloring between the dark red, the gray, the gold on there, and even on the feet. It looks amazing, absolutely. Um, you can see the torso, which is plain, plain uh, red, but it, it works. I think that'll work for the Flash. Like, do you see this? If you see this, you think it looks all red, but it's not, and that decides a meh color, but the back is pretty meh, because there's, there's no dual molding or anything like that, and I guess that's okay. There was no dual molding for Batman in that set either, and I'll talk about that if you guys want to do a video on that minifigure let me know in the comments below um he has a great face the head is plain black like dark red too um i think the face really captures ezra miller um the other side he's smirking too i think that really helps the flash minifig and it makes him look beautiful um now this mold is absolutely amazing um it's a small little helmet, and it's like a lot, what a lot of people wanted for Captain America, but he never got it. Maybe he will get it, I doubt it, but he has the nice gold on the sides, back engraving, looks beautiful, and overall, a great mold. So this figure is pretty good, I'll give it a 10 out of 10. Um, thanks for watching, and if you guys want to see another minifigure, let me know in the comments below. And otherwise, have a great day, and thanks for watching.